Hey everyone, welcome to my channel and welcome to the world of digital planning so this is the first time on this channel we are going to talk about digital planning so if you're new to this channel hi my name is Asia and we have recently launched our 2025 planner collection so this collection includes the life aroma planner 2025 in both physical as well as digital version so in my last video I have talked about the physical planner I have given a complete flip through you can go ahead check this particular video and in in this video we are going to talk about digital planning i'm going to give you a walkthrough of the life aroma digital planner for 2025 so if you have an ipad and want to switch to digital planning then this video is for you so this particular digital planner is all you need to organize your life in 2025 and if you want to purchase any of the 2025 planner collection this is the website link do check it out i will provide all the details in the description box below so this is how the digital planner will look like it is in landscape format you can use it in any note taking app like good notes notability etc so i am using good notes for this purpose as you open it in your app you will find two cover options to choose from so whichever you want to like use you can just keep it you can just go to this left hand corner and choose the thumbnail you want for your cover so these are the two cover options and then we have the planner belongs to page so you can jot down your name here so the planner is fully hyperlinked here you will get all the monthly tabs so if you click on this tab it will take you to that particular month so we have january here february march april so it will just take you to that particular month and you can also access a notes page here so you can click here it will take you to the notes page and you can keep on duplicating the notes pages if you want to and if you are like confused uh, if you want to just go to the home page so here we have a home page here so all you have to do is click on this and it will take you to the home page so this is the index page where you can navigate to different months different activities for that particular month so everything is hyperlinked here also you can just uh, click on uh, these icons this is the YouTube and the Instagram icon and it will straightforward take you to our official YouTube and Instagram page and this is our website if you click on this you can just check out our website from here so this is the basic hyperlink thing that is going on so after the uh, planner belongs to page we have the index and each of these tabs are hyperlinked so if you click on January here it will take you to the January month as you can see again you can click on the home page and it will take you to the index page so all these months are hyperlinked and these are all the yearly pages which are hyperlinked so we have words and intention for the year page so if you click on this it will take you to the uh, words and intention page we have vision board here so just click here and it will take you to the vision board page this is just for a demo purpose i have used some pictures so again you can just uh, if you are confused you can just go to the home page and it will take you to the first page so similarly all the yearly pages are here these are all the quarterly pages so if we want to go to like third quarter suppose so you can just click here and it will take you to the third quarter as you can see so here you can do your mid-year review then we have quarter three planning page so this is how the hyperlink is working and in this section we have all the monthly pages so if you want to do the monthly activity thing then you can just click on this and it will take you to that particular month activity then we have the monthly calendar goals and to do so if you just want to check the goals for march so you can click on this and it will take you to the march goal setting page so these are the trackers journaling pages monthly reflection everything is hyperlinked so you can use it as per your convenience so moving ahead we have the month at a glance page here you can use this section to jot down important highlights uh, you can even stick pictures in this area you can jot down birthdays use different stickers and just use these section this is a perfect section to add any pictures here next we have the yearly intention page so here you have to write down your word for the year your intention for the year affirmation and quote for the year and this section is to write down habits that you want to adopt and habits that you want to quit so you can definitely go ahead fill up this section and just take a note of how your 2025 should look like how do you envision your future self to look like by the year end 
then we have the vision board page so you can stick different pictures here resize different pictures so this is a very convenient way if you're doing it digitally moving ahead we have the goal setting page where you can like set your goals in different categories so you have health and wellness work and career finance goals personal growth goals so you can write down your goals here then you have a morning routine and evening routine page where you can time block your routines here and just have a look at your overall routine which you want to follow ideally for the entire year next to that you can make a weekly reset checklist and a monthly reset checklist moving ahead you have you can make your 2025 glow up plan where you can jot down the goals that you want to set for your physical mental and uh, emotional well-being next to that we have a period tracker you can track your period here you can even make a period checklist here so this page is all about your self-care routine then is a bucket list section here you can write down 25 things that you want to do in 2025 enough space to write down your bucket list here so movies you want to watch places to visit or any experiences that you want to enjoy in 2025 you can just jot it down here next to that we have a letter to my future self section so go ahead write a letter to your future self and come back to this page to see how you have manifested your dreams then we have two notes pages and this notes page can be duplicated as many times as you want to all you have to do is go to this uh, section and just select that page and just duplicate it so you will get two pages here simultaneously and the hyperlink will not be altered even if you duplicate any page so that's not a problem so that's the beauty of a digital planner that you can duplicate any of your page multiple times and then we have the quarter one reflection page here you can do your quarterly reflection and after that the monthly pages start so every month will start with this hyperlinked section so monthly dashboard here these sections are all hyperlinked you can just jump into any of these sections just click on this and it will take you to that particular month's calendar and if you want to just go back to the home page you can click on january hyperlink and it will take you to this page so all the monthly dashboard sections are here divided and we have also the weekly dashboard section here so if you want to go to a particular week so you can just go ahead and click on this so week two so this is the week two which i have just created as a demo so here all the weeks are given so it will be very convenient so if you want to go to week four you can just click on that and it will take you to the week four so the first one is monthly divider you click on that and you will get the monthly divider here so this is the divider you have a blank section here to jot down any important stuff or you can make a monthly vision board here that will be very perfect we have the activity for the month page here we have the monthly a focus board here so you can write down a focus word for the month intention affirmation quotes and a checklist section where you can uh, write down anything that you want to keep a track of then we have the monthly calendar section ample of space to jot down your appointments birthdays any important events etc moving ahead we have the monthly goal setting page so here you can write down the goal category and mini goals that you want to follow for that particular month next to that we have the master to do list section so go ahead brain dump all the things that you want to get done in that particular month and just check it out after you are done and lastly there is a currently section where you can like be present in the moment and also uh, enjoy things that you want to do like what you want to read what you are loving what you are feeling what are you watching what are you celebrating what are you manifesting so be present in the moment and fill up this space then we have a habit tracker so you can write down three habits that you want to focus on in that particular month and you can also score them by the end of the month this is a great way to build habits uh, it's not overwhelming because you have to take care of only three habits for that particular month we have a budget tracker here you can track your income savings and your expenses here in this section next to that we have the highlight section so here you can jot down one highlight from each of the day and just uh, cherish this moment and by the end of the month or by the end of the year so we have ample of space here so you can like use this section to journal one line a day every single day then we have the famous journaling prompt section so this is the journaling prompt for january entering my future era so you can go ahead zoom in here and just journal about these prompts then we have the weeks going on we have vertical layout and the week starts from monday to sunday and if somehow the week starts from 
like Wednesday, the first week of January starts on Wednesday, we will get few prompts here and there. These are all surprise prompts which you can like jot down and this will like break your monotony of using the planner also. So these are the weekly spreads going on and at the end we have the monthly reflection section where you can end the month uh, with writing down things that work for you things that you learned things that drain you out and you can also rate your month here and we have a note section here as well and then the february month starts and so on so let me just give you a sneak peek of february month as well so this is how the february looks like as i said that uh, for the month of february the week is starting from saturday so you will get like journaling prompts here and there so for the month of february i will encourage you to go on a solo date plan a solo date for yourself and here are some prompts that you can use to plan that solo date for yourself so lot of surprises here and there and this will be a very functional way of planning your life with fun and everything this is how the digital planner looks like all right so that's all about the walkthrough of the life aroma digital planner i hope you have got some insight on how you can use a planner digitally if you want to shop the 2025 collection definitely check out the description box below and we are coming up with more products in november so stay tuned for the new launch and i will see you super soon with a new one till then bye bye